In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn any image into ASCII art on Telmax using just two lines of Python code. As you can see, this is what ASCII art looks like when it is printed directly into the terminal. With this method, you will be able to turn multiple images into ASCII art and then save them as an HTML document. Then convert that document into an image to use as your wallpaper. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is find an image to use. I'll be going to pexels.com to download some images. This method works best with images that have a single clear subject and a minimal background. For example, this image of a lion. Once you have an image, open material files and copy your image into the Termax folder. We've already covered how to install and set up material files, so I won't repeat that here. I have a folder with my images, so I'll copy that over to the Termax folder. Once that's done, I'll open Termax. Now navigate to the folder where the images are saved. As you can see, my images are here. We'll be using Python for this, so make sure that you have Python installed on Termax. I'm currently using Python version 3.11.10. Once you have Python installed, use pip to install the ASCII magic package with the command pip install ASCII underscore magic. You can then use the command pip list to check if it is installed correctly. Once that's done, we'll write the Python script to convert the images. I'll be using nano to write the script. In the script, we'll import ASCII art from the ASCII magic package. Next, we'll create a variable called my art and assign it to the ASCII representation of our image using the from function from ASCII art. Please make sure that your image name and extension are correct. From there, we can use the to terminal function to print that image into the terminal. From there, save the file with control plus S and close nano with control plus X. To run the script, type Python followed by the name of your script. This will print out the ASCII version of our image to the terminal. You may need to zoom out to view the image in full. To convert multiple images, you can repeat these two lines for each image, then run the script again and we'll see all your images here. To save the output, you can add this line to the code. This basically takes all our ASCII characters and convert them into an HTML document, saving it to your local storage. To view it, use material files to copy the file out of the Termax folder and opening it using an HTML viewer or a browser. Here's what it looks like in HTML format. You can experiment with the size, sharpness, brightness, and other settings by tweaking the code. I'll leave a link to the ASCII magic documentation in the description down below. To use the ASCII art as your wallpaper, you will need to convert the HTML to a PNG image with an HTML to PNG converter. I'll leave a link to that one in the description as well. Please like the video and leave a comment so more people get to see it. Then, subscribe and hit the bell to join the Vector Legion. That's all I have for this video. I hope to see you in the next one.